Keith, congrats. <laughs> when you look back on today, what are you most proud of? Just the fight and the grit that the ladies showed today. The match had ebbs and flows, ups and downs, and this match is a culmination of all the hard work that they've been putting into, you know, every single day. I'm really, really proud of them. Uh, we had every opportunity to sort of just, just fold. We lost the doubles point. Uh, we did a good job after losing the doubles point of really coming back and getting the first set in every single one of the singles matches. But Army, um, they did a good job. I have to give them credit as well. They did a good job of fighting back and uh, it just didn't know which direction the match was going to go. Uh, Kate Lee, you know, she toughed that match out. She's cramping, and she's sort of limping around, and, and she just found ways to just sort of hang around and just to stick in there and, and to get us the extra point. Michaela, same thing, you know, she was in the process of, uh, I don't know what was going to happen, maybe a tiebreaker for the third set. So it was riveting uh, tennis. I don't know how long we played. It must have been about four hours at least. Um, so I'm really proud of the ladies. You know, we brought it home and we talked to them long and hard about just going out there and just leaving it all out there today. And I think we did that. So you coaching mainly down there with Michaela and Kate. Just what does it say about their perseverance to be able to stick those out for, for three sets? That, that is, that's who we are. That's who we are as a team. I think that's what they've shown um, every single match. Um, I, I said to you when you interviewed me that you were going to see us just go out there and give it everything that we have. That is, that is who we are. Um, and, and I think you saw it today. And um, it, was, it got us the end star. Really spirited tennis, as you mentioned, and Emily starts it off both in doubles and in singles. To what do you owe her just dominance these last few weeks? Well, you know, Emily, she's never been satisfied with, you know, just where she is. She's always looking to get better. And so every single year, she just improves just a little bit, you know, a little bit of something in her game. Uh, and and she was, she's very, very talented, but she's also mentally um, the toughest player that we have. And so you take that, you take those, those qualities of talent, you know, willing to work hard, okay, and mental toughness. And she's, she's a really, really tough customer to beat because uh, Cooper, whom she played, Cooper Jackson, who she played in Army, again, that's another all-conference performer, first team all-conference performer. And uh, she's, just, um, she's, just, she's just playing you know, great ball, doing a great job of helping to lead this team. General thoughts, winning the star, how does it feel to get it done here at home? It feels great. It feels great at home, especially with everyone watching. Like, it was definitely, the energy was brought, and I'm so proud of everyone, because on the back of our chairs is not for self, and we really fought out there for each and every one of the people watching and on the court. So I'm very happy to win it for our team and then for everyone at the academy. One of the benefits of getting done first in doubles and in singles, you get to watch all your teammates play. So yeah. you got to see Sam go two sets. What, what did I you did. see I, I just saw a bunch of fight, like as always. All of us are putting out every single time, and that's why our team has come together so well over time because we never stop fighting, and that's the biggest thing from us. And I think we work hard in practice, we work hard on the on the on and off the court, and that's really that's really brought the biggest thing together for our team. I'm very proud of all of us, just watching and seeing them all. What do you cherish the most out of that final moment? Katie gets the, the game-winning point, you all kind of love her. What's that like? I, it's just an amazing feeling. Where it's just it's all pure joy, just running up and just seeing her fight through that match, even though she was cramping. like That's a huge fight, huge warrior spirit right there. And, and just all of us bonded together, and all the hard work just pays off. Like That's the biggest thing we cherish. We're very grateful for our team. and. Like just putting out all the time, very happy for them. And you want to talk about a warrior? You've been dominant of late, and today you gave it your all in the doubles and winning the, the singles point mm -hmm. here against Cooper. Um, what was the key today? The key is just keep fighting and staying out there. Like they, we knew that they were going to bring it. Um, so just the hard work that we've put in throughout, like since the beginning of the season to now, has all been left out on the court here. And just staying out there and competing, keeping a steady mind and knowing what my strengths are to compete against hers, and that's the biggest thing at the end of the day, just making sure you stay true to your game. What are those strengths that you've been tapping into? I just the fight, honestly. I keep, my serve was pretty, uh, doing pretty well today. I, had, uh, I just felt, I felt very good. My moving was good. Uh, ground strokes were pretty solid, and um, I felt very good out there, so um, had a good out outcome. What else am I missing? I, I don't know. Huh? Anything else you'd like people to know? Um, I'm just thankful for our, the coaching and support staff out here. Like, 
Because we were all together and on one mission, one fight, I think that's why we come together so well. I couldn't have done it by myself. Like everyone here pushes each other and that's why we are doing so great. So I'm very, very grateful.